hi and welcome back to another video guys and today i'll be teaching you a really really cool mentalism trick with the books so i'm gonna do the performance first and then i'll teach you how to do it yourself so would you like to select the big harry potter book or the small book so let's say the small book all right so i'm just gonna say stop i'm gonna close my eyes and i'm just gonna say stop Stop right about there. So that is page 144. Let's close the book there. 144. So I'm going to scroll to 144. Right there. So of course I didn't look there, but can you please memorize the word? In that top left hand corner right there okay I promise you I did not see it it was a completely random page number and without looking I'm gonna try a bit of mentalism here I'm gonna try and guess what word that is I'm getting a sense right now of it's a it has a J in it yeah also has an I N G D yes getting a sense now it's judging that's the word. It's judging. It is. So that is the trick, guys. And now for the tutorial. So first, what you're going to need, you're going to need a big book, this one here, and a small book, which is marginally smaller than this. So what you're going to do first in the small book, before you perform this, is find any page number you want. Let's take a hundred and say and look at that word, the top left hand corner. So then, alright, that's then one hundred. One hundred. Then that's all you need to remember. You close the book and that's the preparation needed. So then you take your big book and your small book and you're gonna say a move. So the reason why I said you're going to say it is called a magician's fourth. It's where you can make someone think that they should pick this one because I said it in a way that they should. Now, look, when I said the big book, would you like the big book? I kept it in my hands like that, kind of keeping it close to me as if I didn't want them to pick it. Do you want the big book? Keep it towards myself. Or the small book and then hand that out to them like... Come on, take this. And then let's say they take the small book, because you use the magician's force. And if they don't take the small book and just say, um, you know what, let's just use the, let's use, just use the small book for the stamp. Even though they say the big book, just whatever happens, just make sure it's that one. And then get your big book after they have the small book and you flick through and they just say stop. So if they say stop right here, it doesn't, it doesn't really, it's not the page number, it's not 100 that you remembered. So you just say any any page number you want that you memorise. So even if they stop like way further on in the book, like 758, you could say, say okay, you stopped at page 100. So fake whatever page they stop at, pretending that it was page 100 or whatever page you memorised in that book. And then they go to page 100 in this book. There we go, 100. You don't look at it. And remember that's the one you memorised? And you say, look at the word in the top left-hand corner. And then you can present this in any way you want. And you can reveal that it was then. And I will always be amazed by this. And the first time I saw this, I was absolutely blown away. So hope you guys enjoyed it please like and subscribe to this channel and also comment in the comment box below what you would like to see next thanks for watching